Hello YouTube, my name's Dave. Welcome to my workshop in a single car garage here in South Australia. Come on in and let's see what we can make. What you're looking at is the uh, wood burning stove that I built for my neighbour. It's made out of four uh, steel wheel rims. Uh, we'll move in a bit closer and uh, give you a bit more of a, a bit more of a look. <coughs> now I've added on the top uh, the rail to stop any saucepans or frying pan getting knocked over. Uh, what else have we got? Come down here and I'll, I'll open the door. Yeah. I don't know what you can make that out inside there. There's uh, three brackets that I've uh, welded in that, that actually take a uh, ceramic pizza plate so when the fire's died down we can uh, do, do home baked uh, pizza. Now these numbers that you can see below that is a uh, air inlet valve to the, to the um, fire basket. By sliding that along it uh, it uh, there's there's a hole underneath. It, it, it opens it opens a, a, about a two inch hole. Uh, and also on the top is I've uh, I've included a uh, butterfly on the on the vent on on the chimney so that we can um, uh, at, at the moment when that's upright that that's fully open because we can we can and, and that is that is fully shut and obviously we can adjust it in between to to you know to help with the help with the fire drawing up. Um, yeah, it's taken me nearly a year to do it for him, but uh, you know he wasn't in any, any particular panic. Um, the, the the wheels at the bottom, uh, the, the, the the sorry, which side of the wheels? I mean the, the the front legs have actually got got rollers inside them, and round the back, um, the back one is uh, solid on the ground, so it doesn't move. And here we have a uh, that's that's a that's a lift up handle for moving it. Uh, as you can see, I mean, hopefully uh, we're going to get this fired up in the next day or two. So hopefully next time you uh, you see this, you'll uh, you'll see it uh, actually uh, put a fire inside and hopefully some uh, water boiling on the top with and perhaps even even a, a, an egg being fried uh, over and out for now. So here we are. We're all uh, set up, ready for uh, a firing. Um, we better do a few checks first. So. Let's come up here first and say, right, is the uh, <coughs> is the flue damper opened? Yes. Check. Do we have sufficient timber? Yes. Check. Is the uh, fire basket air valve fully open? No. It is now. Check. And is the fire laid? Yes, so there we are, I'm in there. See that, nice and laid. All ready for lighting, so pre-check is done. Uh, now ready for lighting. Right, here we go, it's uh, it's firing it up time. So we'll uh, come in here and uh, see what sort of... So there was the test firing. Um, went reasonably well. Didn't go quite according to plan. Um, you know, because as, as I said earlier, you know, we, we were hoping to, uh, you know, cook some eggs on the top and a, and a pizza inside. But as you could see, it was, 
it was the his son's birthday party and he was running about like a headless chicken trying to trying to keep the lad amused and, and all these guests and things so and the other thing was he was a little bit concerned that although I'd sort of cleaned the ground off and wire brushed and, and, and uh, wiped down the, the outside of the um, stove he was a bit concerned that until, until it had really been heated up um, you know he, he was reluctant to, to get any food near it and saying I must admit as, as you might have seen in, in the in the initial shots, I mean the, the outside did smoke a little bit but uh, as I say that, that, that soon went so um, so so what's now needed is a, is, a, is, a, is another go um, and, and, and next time we're, we're just going to make the four of us there so that we've got no interruptions and, and we can do uh, and we can do whatever with it so um, over and out for now should be back when we've done the uh, second and hopefully uh, successful test firing I'll catch you soon bye ah so here we are again this is now going to be the uh, the second firing of the uh, of this stove and saying this time we're hopefully going to boil, hard boil some eggs on the top and when the fire dies down um, we're going to do some pizza on it let's uh, light the thing up and hopefully this time I won't singe the hairs on my hand like happened last time so here we go ah that's better look at that oh she's away now oh that's lovely cool smoke coming out the top not that we can see it yes we've got smoke coming out the top yeah. here we are egg is boiling we I'll boil eggs for my lunch tomorrow oh. lovely jubbly Looking forward to that. Hey. So here we are. Fire's died down. Ready for pizza time. Hey. And there's the pizza being put on the pizza plate. You could, you know. There we go. Hey. And we shove it into the into the jolly old fire. All the way in. Lovely, lovely. Now we just need to close the door. Uh, and there we are. We now we just got to wait for it to cook. About eight or nine minutes. We'll get back to you later. And here's the pizza all cooked up. Twelve minutes cooking time at uh, about two twenty in the oven. Uh, looks yummy. Here we are, pizza, super, just had a lump, it's uh, very tasty. We're uh, going to put a second one in now, so we'll uh, catch you on that one, hopefully, bye for now. Well, so there we have it, the, uh, the second test fire, and, and uh, I don't know about you, but I, I consider that uh, a great success. Um, it, was, it, it, it all went well, you know, I, I, boiled, I boiled two eggs for, for my lunch, um, we cooked two pizzas, um, and in fact um, his wife then uh, came out and, and, and uh, fried some sausages on the top and she also got him to um, to wrap up some sweet potato in foil with a, with a bit of butter and a bit of salt and, and that went in for about 20 odd minutes um, on, on the dying embers so uh, yeah great success all round and he's decided at the moment that um, we won't do anything about um, uh, painting the, the, the thing because he, he quite likes the, the patina that the that the um, heat has caused so um, he's going to run it over the winter and, and see what happens because somebody told him that oh don't worry about a little bit of rust you know when it, when it fires up again it, it, it'll all just burn off so and he, he was a bit concerned because he, he, even though he, he was going to buy this um, high temperature paint you know that you use on um, uh, car engine manifolds Apparently it still eventually burns off, so um, 
<coughs> that's what he's decided to do. So as far as I'm concerned, uh, I'm finished with the job, and he's and he's, he's more than happy with it. So um, that's another job out the door. I uh, wonder what he's going to think up for me next. So um, that's it. So as per usual, thanks once again for for watching. Please subscribe, ring the bell, click the like, send me a, a, a message, good or bad, or, or an email. Um, so. Until you see me again on the uh, next video, wherever you are in the world, please stay safe, well and happy, and catch you on the next video. Bye!